bro. All right, finally we find an all-electric truck here. Let's go check it out. So how big is the battery? Yeah. 105 kilowatts of base, 135 and 180 kilowatt hours. Oh, there's a uh, single motor? Quad motor, all wheel drive. Four motors. Oh, right now, look at this. Up to 180 kilowatt hour battery pack, right? 440 miles of range, they're saying with that. Of course, yeah, it's almost 200 kilowatt hours. Zero to 60 in three seconds. Uh, he said it's about a 400 uh, volt pack. And, you know, it's got four independent motors, all wheel drive. This is gonna be a really, really cool electric. Pretty, pretty awesome. I believe so much in this car that I've actually placed a pre-order for one of their cars. They are going to be pricing, even though I can't afford them at this point. They are not going to deliver into two years from now, so I don't expect to be broke in two years. I expect to be in a better place financially to be able to afford to buy one of these vehicles. And so if that is the case, then you will see me riding around on a Rivian. All right, we're live at the uh, fully charged event here in Austin, and we're gonna go check out the Rivian people. Rivian is going to be my first brand new store-bought electric vehicle. We own a Model 3 that is for my wife. I drive my classic uh, Volkswagen ZIY electric cars, but this is gonna be the first one I'm gonna buy. I am a fan of the SUVs more so than the trucks, but I did pre-order a truck just because I knew that was going to be the first uh, one to hit the market. And so then I, uh, I got the truck and then also the SUV. I really got to have candid conversations with the engineers. And I am surprised that uh, some of these guys are, are kind of DIY and they have their own conversions. And as no surprise would be, they watch my channel. It's just pretty weird thing that uh, these guys that are you know, pretty involved in the design and engineering of this, I mean, this next company that I think will probably be as big as Tesla, right? Um, on the utility side of the electric vehicles moving forward, you know, they watch my videos, which is crazy. So Rivian is holding these first mile events where they you can test drive the Rivian and so we're here to do that uh, oh. we could just we could just move in there and just yeah. live there yeah this is this my house now okay? right Bye. Uh, I'll, I'll see you now we'll, you just uh, drive on to your next address and then you're like eh. get up there all right yeah Yep. Okay, I'm finally gonna get to do a Rivian test drive. I've uh, been waiting for this for three years now, so finally gonna happen. Okay, so here's Crystal getting into her Rivian for the first time. That's me. <laughs> why <laughs> did case, you choose? In case you didn't know. Why did you choose uh, gray? Because it <laughs> it was calling my name. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Suck it in. Let's do it. Let's get a thumbnail. Let's <laughs> do <laughs> Back up a little there bit. Back up so you get the whole truck. <laughs> yeah. There we go. Oh. Oh man. See, if you don't fit in the back seat, you can ride down here. So you get the whole truck. Whoa. Okay, back up more. Get all the way back here. I'm right here. That way you get the whole truck. There you go. <laughs> Sure and you're pretty short, so your feet aren't touching the other end, right? Yeah, I knew it. <laughs> it has a button so you can get out. Look at that. They thought about it. Yep. Hey, you know what? This is probably bigger than some of those Japanese hotel rooms. <laughs> or so I heard. What's happening here? He's actually and cooking. And of 
course, I'm gonna have to let Crystal do the, the drive because it's gonna be her car, right? Uh, I might get to drive it whenever she lets me, but uh, we'll see how it goes. Thank you. Really? See? Tell people. <laughs> yeah, that was probably me. Here you go. Oh, it's got kind of a, an automatic to it. Oh. Oh. Awesome. Yeah, so as your, as your co-pilot, I'm going to be handling everything on this screen here. We've got drive modes, ride height, uh, suspension, uh, stiff or soft for, um, for sport driving or off-road. Mm -hmm. So, have you dri you've driven an EV before? Um, yeah, I have a Tesla. Awesome. Um, how about off-roading? Mm -mm. How about <laughs> off-roading in an EV? No, no. ma'am. All right, let's check that off our bucket list today. Maybe. Everyone buckle in. Ready. Okay, except Perfect. for that one time though that you... That was an accident. <laughs> okay. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> do it. Um, so we are going to use our drive stock to go into the drive, into drive here. Mm -hmm. Perfect. If you take your foot off the brake, you'll notice the hold. Mm -hmm. um, it'll hold for you. Additionally, you don't have to put your foot on the brake mm -hmm. um, when you put it into reverse. Oh, okay. So if we just touch it into reverse right now, beautiful. Mm -hmm. Brings us to our uh, rear view uh, backup cameras. We'll be using the front cameras to go over some hills and things today. So it is awesome to so use So there's this. cameras on both sides of the... Yeah. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. So these, mm -hmm. I want to say they're um, in our side mirrors. Uh-huh. Yeah, and then if we go up to the front. I, I could have used that this morning. <laughs> there we go. All right. Shall we get started? Sure. Awesome. So we're gonna uh push it down again back into drive and we're gonna head to the right here. Okay, just kidding, I can't reach. That was a little too high. But I'm I'm glad you can move this without moving this. Yeah, right? Yes. Okay. Additionally, these seats have uh, heated and cooled, so it's really nice in the summertime. And they have a USB plug over here. Uh, is it like is on the back of the head? Yeah, USB, and uh, also like purse hanger or umbrella hanger. Yeah. Now, there's, there's plugs everywhere. And USB-C plugs. Yeah. I'm not sure if you want your heat, heat oh, no. seats on. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So awesome. So we are going to head to our, our right here. And uh, at that last hay bale, we're gonna come to a complete stop. And the flyer's gonna let us know if we are good to go. Okay. Oh, I haven't driven a truck in a while. This thing's big. We used to own a, a pilot, which is about smaller. I think it's smaller. Flagger. Still stop? Yeah, so we can head to the right here. Okay. And we will uh, maintain 15, okay? Um, I'm sorry, you said you used to own a truck? A Honda Pilot, which oh. is about a SUV about this size, or a little bit smaller. Yeah, um, I used to work for Carvana, um, so the Pilots were were always uh, purchased. Um, I want to say, an additional, in addition to um, like the Buick Encore and things like that for families. Yeah. Um, which is why the SUV and truck market is like blowing up. Yes. Yeah, because she got a Tesla, and it's cool. I mean, it's an amazing car. But uh, yeah, I guess she misses the, like, just the size, you know, to right. being able to pick up five friends, you know? I didn't and... <laughs> miss paying for the gas. <laughs> that one, that's, true. that's true. So we can accelerate to 230. But, but yeah, um, just, you know, gas, uh, in addition to the zero to 60, um, it's just phenomenal. There's no traditional, you know, uh, there's no lag of a traditional vehicle. Mm -hmm. So it's just super. Maybe. So here with uh, your hands on 10 and 2, we mm -hmm. are going to make some swift uh, like lane changes almost. Yeah. Get a feeling for the body roll. <laughs> <laughs> this isn't one of those uh, dirt road pavements, so, you know, with your Tesla. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so we'll go straight ahead here. We're gonna head straight. We're going to stay to the uh, right side, and we'll, we'll go down along this. Uh, I want to say billboard or fence. Okay. And we'll do forty. Forty. Oh, the doors lock again? Or do they? They don't lock when you put it in drive. Yeah, they were locked. Oh. It sounded like. Could have been a rock. It's, it's 
sounded like it was a click. Uh-huh. With this walkie in my ear, it's, it's uh, a little hard to hear. Oh, okay. And then we have people saying, secret, you know, suspects on the move. <laughs> I'm kidding. Pop a smurf. <laughs> yeah, pop a smurf, right? Smurf targets on the move. move. So here we are going to go uphill. Okay. I'm going to change it. Oh, feel that regenerative road. breaking! <laughs> and we'll head um, straight up here. We'll, we'll go to the right and then we'll make another hard right. Okay. Here you'll, it'll really focus on the uh, bumps. So you'll notice like potholes and things. And uh -huh. that's like no big deal. For example, right here. So I don't have to slow down. No. I just keep going. Yeah, we can keep oh, going. Oh, wow. Look at that. Just like nothing. So off road, auto, high. Yeah. That Truck's like whatever. <laughs> what yeah. was that, you know? <laughs> Woo! And then we're gonna continue here and we're gonna go straight ahead, sort of like into the sky. Okay. Blast off! I know, right? Launch rocket. <laughs> <laughs> so I have um this is like the coolest job in the world. Yep. Um I feel like like I feel like something cooler would just be NASA, I don't know. <laughs> Artichoke Valley, I like to call it. Oh, they're recording. What wow, up? The media team out here today. <laughs> and here we'll do our country road at 25. Take me home. I was telling them yesterday, I was like, that's the only part of the song I know. I know, right? <laughs> yeah, I don't even know the rest. What'd you say, 25? Yeah, you're doing great. So, so this is the team that records all those that media coverage that is on the website and yeah, the thing social and the news. media posts and such. Oh, that's cool. I know. Should I introduce you later? Yeah. At that, uh, at that sign there, we're going to come to a complete stop. Uphill Vista. Okay, that's that's a serious hill up there. We are going to turn on our cameras here. So we are, we're going to maintain speeds of 7 to 10. Um, and then towards the top, we're not going to be able to see over you're going to really rely on our front uh cameras here um, so when you reach the top we're going to slightly angle to the left and come to a stop for a photo op okay perfect okay yeah that's i don't no sheep though i think i'm gonna hit i don't think it's you <laughs> can appreciate somewhere. in the video but this is a really high steep I would never here. do this on yeah. my own. That's what I'll tell you right now. And then all of a sudden, yeah, you can't see in front of the car. <laughs> but you're seeing. We'll stop here. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go ahead and reverse. <laughs> oh, because you were supposed to turn over there. <laughs> oh, it's okay. I heard a little angle to the left. I thought she just meant the wheels, not yeah, the and, turn. And okay. then we'll pull forward. Mm -hmm. And we'll come to a complete stop. Perfect. Right here. Okay. Awesome. We will push this button into park. And if someone would like to give me their phone, I can jump out and get a photo. All right. Here we go. Yeah, if you do. you to do is um press on the accelerator okay all right i got my old bar ready head back against and three two one okay <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that was intense and we were going uphill yeah wow Should we punch it again <laughs> wow it's 
And so that was on, on what setting? Is it like sports mode? Yeah, or? so that was in sport mode. Sport mode, okay. It distributes uh, power to the rear wheels. Uh, um, we're going to be continuing. Straight? Yep. Oh, okay. Straight! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so sport mode distributes power to the rear wheels, similar to, you know, like a Ford Vet, Jack Viper. Um, and then conserve mode here distributes power to the front two wheels, um, also saving, you know, energy. And then you have the all-purpose, which is all-wheel drive for your daily commute, um, things like that. Ah. Yeah. Uh -huh. and then you can feel like the hug of the road. Body roll a little bit was way different from when we first started. And then here you'll notice this dirt path. Okay. We're going to pop it back into all-purpose, mm -hmm. and we're going to head up this dirt path here. Okay. three years to, to get this test track. Are you even more excited for your configuration? Yes. I don't even remember what I put on it. I just yeah, remember it's like, been a while. White. Yeah. <laughs> that was the only thing I remember putting. I don't believe we have a white one out here today, but it looks great, uh, especially, you know, because I've only liked white uh, in regards to like Cadillac white, you know, mm -hmm. like the pearl mm -hmm. white, mm -hmm. but our white has like a pearl, like, uh, iridescent to it too. And I yeah. like these other colors, but just again, because it gets so where I work, it's just there's wind, there's a bunch of diesel trucks all the time, like it's just dirty. Yeah. So I'm like, oh. Which one is the first edition green? So the, the launch is in is launch. in the infield with the bike on top. Oh, that one. Yeah, this one here. Oh, because that's a little bit lighter, I guess is like a hunter green or something? Yeah, this is our forest. Okay. Uh, forest. And then, then, then that one's more of a, not matte, but uh, like an army green? Yeah, uh, yeah, army green's perfect. I remember thinking like, oh, I want the launch edition, but I don't want that green because I don't know, maybe in person I'm going to be like, oh, I should have gotten it, but. Right. <laughs> yeah, all the colors look so different in person. In like person. they look better, you know, check out yeah. yellow. Where's, yeah, that one too. I yeah, yellow grows that. on you. Where's um that speaker? Yeah, so the speaker is right oh, here. Oh, it is here. Okay. I was looking there, but I didn't realize it Bluetooth was there. speaker. Um, you can charge your phone right here as well. Uh-huh. Additionally, you have the entering holder oh, too. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, and if you were to leave this speaker uh, like at home, uh -huh. it would give you extra space uh, under here as well for stuff. Oh, to put stuff in there. Additionally, when the vehicle this. is in drive, this won't. You can't remove it. Oh, okay. So, so that's it locks just, it in there. Yeah, so it just locks it in there, and then you park, or you know, you put it wherever. And these are oh, motorized. Oh, nice. Or no? What, what did you do to re yeah, there's release a little button? button? Right there. There's a little button. Okay. Oh, okay. okay. So it's a lock that takes Jamie, your sound. mother's going to love these these handles. Yeah, oh, cool. she missed that when... Uh... <laughs> like a carabiner for when you yeah. go, you know, rock climbing, climbing. or things like that. <laughs> Should open. So, yeah, you, oh, so you could actually oh, just pull. use it. Oh, as a, okay, okay. Put it in your bag. Like an actual, yeah, like yeah. an actual keychain. Okay. Nice. Yeah. It locks in there. That's awesome. cool. Cool, right? Very, very cool. We like it. Do we get to like peek in the back with the? Yeah, if you yeah, if you'd like, I'll I'll show you right now. The bed of the truck. Yes, yes, absolutely. Let's take a look, sir. Your ride is over. <laughs> Thank you. It was a little bumpy. 
you, you could have been nicer to. Nope. No? 